Alright guys, so to kick things off, uh, for those of you who don't know who I am, my name is Zach Lipka. I grew up in the western New York region of New York in a town called Allegheny. To cut right to the chase, uh, my answer to your question of why I was on the scale will be answered momentarily, but I just want to let everyone know what my lifestyle is, and I am a UPS driver, and I am a married father of three kids, under three. Uh, so you can probably imagine just how busy life can be in this house. Over the last three years, I actually have been creating a different type of success in silence. Uh, I've gotten married, I had a career change. I had three kids who are now under three years old. I traded in my little Nissan Sentra 2014 for a Dodge Ram. Um, Homeowner, garage gym owner, two dogs, like, it's a whole different type of success and I needed to put bodybuilding on hold to be able to create any of this. And I wouldn't have been able to do any of this without the help of my wife. For today's first dinner on the eight week shred program, we have 330 grams of vegetable blend with two mini kiwi fruits and chicken for protein. All right guys, so now that dinner is cleaned up and finished, we are going to the gym. Uh, this is some bucked up pre-workout. Uh, the flavor is blue raz. It's got 200 milligrams of alpha size, six grams of L-citrulline and deer antler velvet. Today is day one of the eight week shred program customized by me, 100%. For those who are paying attention, I stepped on the scale this morning, weighing 168.2 pounds. The goal is to go from 168 pounds to 150. That's a little over two pounds lost each week if I get to eight weeks. It shouldn't honestly be too difficult for me to do this at all because of my job as a UPS driver. I'm constantly on my feet moving around and carrying packages to people's homes and businesses. People tend to have this misinterpreted idea that because I'm a package car driver for UPS, that all I do is drive around town. That's not the case at all. I actually walk and deliver more than I drive. And depending on the route, it can range somewhere between 100 to 200 stops a day. The job is actually very intense and physical and isn't for everyone, believe me. The job has kept me active and fit enough throughout the last couple of years to keep me somewhat in shape. For those who do know me already, they know I was very active in the bodybuilding community before I got married and had kids. I haven't touched a weight in three years, so everything will be like start, starting from scratch. The only thing that won't be from scratch is my background mentality in bodybuilding and the proper form behind the movements. Most people watching this are probably concerned that I'm returning after three years of inactivity. The important thing to remember is that reason why you originally started at the very beginning. For most people, it seems it's to gain self-confidence and pick up chicks and guys, and it seems some people use it as motivation to better themselves in all aspects of life. That, that was actually my reason at the very beginning. Some people use it as their antidepressant, when all things seem to be upside down at the time, whether that be because of heartbreak, job stress, relationship problems, unexpected vehicle or house repairs, abstinence from drug use, you name it. The gym is the place that I'll give it to you straight. Over the last three years, I'd be utterly lying if I said I didn't miss that. I can't tell you how many times I've missed having the ability to throw some weight around the gym and leave it all there. I'd always feel better leaving than I did coming in. 
I guess you could say that's the point of it all, to better yourself. Nothing about fitness should be a negative thing for you. It's all about self-improvement. So don't let anyone else tell you different. If you don't have any motivation most days, remember the why and remember the people around you. I promise you'll be inspiring someone whether it seems like it or not in that exact moment. Over the next few days, you're going to see content revealing progression on lifts, personal physique, body weight, and tips to get you moving in the right direction. Until then, please enjoy the rest of the workout and leave any feedback or questions below. Please remember that this is 100% raw footage with an iPhone, not a professional filming camera, as I don't have a filmer attached to my hip for live footage. Okay guys, we've officially reached the end of episode one, Lipka Shreds, uh, 2022. We will be posting new content soon, episode two. I, I don't have a date yet. Uh, it really depends on my work schedule. Uh, being a UPS driver, you never really know when you're gonna get home. So we'll play by ear. I'll keep you all posted. Please like, comment, subscribe, anything you can do to Pass the word on that Lipka has returned to bodybuilding. Um, any questions, please ask me. Uh, if I don't get back to you, usually my wife is really close by. So stay tuned. Best is yet to come. I'm bringing my best package in three years of a layoff. So everyone be ready. <laughs>